are going to be talking about an American style key cylinder. A couple of things to note is that the height of the American style key cylinder can either be one inch or one inch and one sixteenth of an inch. The pins are oriented on top of the key cylinder and are vertical. And this tailpiece right here can rotate 180 degrees, meaning that it has two horizontal orientations and one vertical orientation. What that means is that when we go to install it into a lock mechanism, you can see here that the hole that we would install it in is horizontal meaning that we would have a 50% chance of installing it correctly because this has two horizontal orientations. Because it only has one vertical orientation, if we switch this to its vertical orientation, we have a 100% chance of installing it correctly, like so. Now, if you have a lock that does not have a vertical or horizontal orientation, but instead has an orientation that is diagonal like this, don't panic. All we have to do is take our key cylinder, orient the tailpiece in a way that will fit into the diagonal hole and slide it in for installation. Simple as that. Now we are going to show you how to install a American style key cylinder onto a sliding patio door. Now we're going to be installing this Pella handle set into this sliding glass patio door. The key cylinder hole is oriented diagonally for this door, so we're going to make sure that the tailpiece of the interior portion of the handle set is also oriented diagonally. We're going to take the handle set, make sure that the tailpiece lines up with the hole, and it should just slide right in. Take your installation screws, place them inside here. You might have to wiggle it around a little bit depending on where it is. Once you have the screws slotted, it should hold the interior portion of the handle set in place while you install the exterior portion of the handle set. In order to install the exterior portion of the handle set, again, we're just going to orient this tailpiece in a diagonal fashion to match the diagonal hole of the cylinder here. We're going to slot it in and make sure that it becomes flush with the door. Once that is done, all you have to do is screw the screw through this and into here, and you will have successfully installed a Pella handle set on a sliding glass patio door. If you have any questions, leave a comment on the bottom of this video or you can contact us at allaboutdoors.com.